Assalamu alaikum everybody. May the peace and mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala shower upon all of you. A'uzu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Welcome to our channel Taqwa. Today we are going to start our channel's first video with the mercy and blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Do you know that the Quran ul Karim mentioned a great number of things 1400 years back which modern science has discovered very recently today we will be discussing one of the miracles of the Quran in this video a strange phenomenon is found in this world where two oceans do not mix with each other although they meet and flow side by side this rare event is known as holocline in scientific terms, which happens because of the difference of salinity between the two oceans. If you visit the place where the Atlantic Ocean meets the Pacific Ocean, you will see that the two vast water bodies meet each other but there remains a mysterious invisible border between them. We can also see this phenomenon where the river meets the sea. That means when fresh water meets the salt water. For your convenience, a list of the famous places is provided in the description of the video. We thankfully acknowledge that the link is cited from a video made by the bright side. The link of the video is also provided in the description below. You can definitely watch it for further explanation of Holocline. However, if we look at the history, then we will see that this magnificent phenomenon was first scientifically observed and researched by a French explorer called Jacques Cousteau in the 1950s when he was working on his first research book entitled The Silent World. He noticed this strange barrier between the two water bodies while deep diving in the Straits of Gibraltar. Furthermore, if we look at the etymology of the word Halocline, we will see that according to dictionary.com, the word Halocline was first recorded between 1955 and 1960. Now it's time to find out what the Quran says about the barrier between the two oceans. Ma rajal bahraini yal takiyan Bainahuma barzahun la yabkiyan He released the two seas meeting side by side. Between them is a barrier that neither of them transgresses. The Quran also mentioned in Surah Al-Furqan about the salinity of the water while talking about the barrier between fresh water and salt water. It is he who has let free the two bodies of flowing water, one palatable and sweet and the other salty and bitter. Yet has he made a barrier between them, a partition that is forbidden to be passed. Now. 1400 years back, in a region covered with endless deserts, how could the Quran miraculously talk about something that is first of all found in the middle of the giant oceans and secondly can only be discovered by a stubborn sea explorer like Jacques Cousteau? Thank you so much for being with us. If you like this video, Please join the family and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click on the bell icon to get the notification of our future videos. But above all, please keep us in your prayers. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide and protect us till the end of time. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.